religions. Oh, oh, I think we're offending Rosemary. No, no. Oh, you're not religious, my dear, are you? Well, I, I was brought up a Catholic. Now I don't know. Yeah, you looked uncomfortable. Oh, no. Well, he is the Pope. Well, now, you don't need to have respect for him because he pretends that he's holy. Now, that's a good point. When I think what they spend on robes and jewels... A good picture of the hypocrisy behind organized religion was given, I thought, in Luther. Did you ever get to play that leading part, Guy? Me? No. Oh, weren't you Albert Finney's understudy? No. Well, that's strange. I remember being struck by a gesture you made and checking in the program to see who you were. Um, what gesture was that? Well, I know, I'm not sure now. It was a reaction. A... Oh, I, I did a thing with my arms when Luther was having a fit. It was a kind of involuntary reach. That's it. That's it. It had a wonderful authenticity to it. <laughs> oh, come on. No, no, I mean it. Uh, my father was a theatrical producer, and my early years were spent in the company of Mrs. Fisk, Forbes, Robertson, Modjeska. Guy? Mm -hmm. Oh, yes, please. You have a most interesting inner quality, Guy. It appears in your television work, too. It should take you a long way indeed, provided, of course, that you get those initial breaks. Are you preparing for a show now? Um, well, I'm up for a couple of parts. Well, I can't believe that you won't get them. Well, I can't.